So this morning, as I'm driving in, I always listen to the overnight show, whoever's on, or it's Tony or JJ or Sal Licata or whomever, and I hear them talking about us, about the Boomer and Geo guess the spread thing, and they wanted to guess the lines because JJ, who came on here last week, won the guess the spread over Boomer, and Boomer didn't believe they didn't look at the lines. So JJ's whole point was, I'll show Boomer. I'll do it right now in the middle of the night on a Monday. And I'll show him I didn't look at the lines and I'll nail the lines. So I want to do guess the spread here with Harris and Flegelman, and we'll do it, and it'll be great. So then he does this whole thing. Do we have the blessing? Do we have the blessing of the morning show to do guess the spread here? Can we get Al in here? So then Al walks in. He's like, Al, do we have the blessing? You know, and then Al's going, uh, what is this now? What would you like us to What? Do we have the blessing to do the thing? Yeah, I think that would be fine. That would be great. Okay, we're going to do it. We're going to come back and we're going to do it. We're going to do it. So they come back and they proceed to have like <laughs> the worst seven-minute segment that they've ever had to their own admission. Like, so Harris has no idea. So it's supposed to be JJ and Flegelman, the producer, against one another with Harris reading the lines. Harris can't find the lines. Hmm. They hand him JJ's cell phone, right? JJ's cell phone <laughs> is in front of Harris. Harris has two lines in front of him. He doesn't know which one is which. He's like, um, excuse me, is it the live line or is it the open line? Well, what do we want to do, Fleeks? Do we want to do this? Do we want to do that? I don't know. Maybe we'll do it this way. We'll do it that way. Then Harris goes, hmm. Your phone, mm, I just lost the page. Mm. Oh, and then your phone went dark on me. You promised me it wouldn't go dark. Pass codes 37133, Harris. Let's go. Let's get it together. And then it, it was it fell completely apart from there. Even worse, where JJ goes, he says, all right, we're going to have to scrap this thing. We're going to have to scrap this thing. We're going to have to start over. We're going to have to do something different now. And the morning show, they're going to have a field day with this. The morning show is going to have a field day with this, by the way. And we were just listening back to it, but it's just like so oh, long man. and so bad that I didn't want to play it. it was well thought thing. out. You know what? It, it's good that it's in the middle of the night as opposed um, to like like one o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> it's just great. Uh, excuse me, uh, JJ. Just to make sure that I don't uh, mess this thing up. Do, do I do this? Do I? I don't know. We should do. It. This is what happens when you don't plan it out. This is what happens here. <laughs> uh, on a fact. <laughs> Now, no you, planning on a fact. Were you laughing or cringing when you were listening to this? Oh, I was laughing. I was okay. laughing my ass off. It was unbelievable. Now, Al, did you hear any of it, or did you just leave after you gave the blessing? Yeah, I gave the blessing, and I... You left, so you didn't out the hear door. any of this. I did not. But okay. then Harris came to you, didn't he? Afterwards? Well, yeah, right. When I when he saw me in the hallway, he said, that did not go well. <laughs> 